is for the mind. Your word is for the mind. Try to save my soul tonight. Now it's nobody's fault but mine. What a difference in the VIP room today. I just pan it around and you can see it's Monday. It's the final day. It's about 5.30. I just saw um, Jeff Martin from Tea Party. Party. He was fantastic, played some Led Zeppelin tunes and I'm about to see Mark Seymour and his undertow. So yeah, just wanted to show you the VIP area. Um, a bit different to the last few nights but it'll probably get packed later. Easter Monday was the last day of the festival and wow, it went out with a, a total bang. Jeff Martin, he played, uh, he's from the Tea Party, he played a lot of Led Zeppelin songs and just, yeah, again, sensational, loved it. Um, Mark Seymour and The Undertow, I've been watching Mark Seymour and his band for quite a few years now and never fails to impress me. They are such a fine bunch of musicians. Their music is just phenomenal. He did throw in some Hunters and Collectors song and that always gets the crowd going.
Mark Seymour also looked really content. I kind of noticed he had a smile on his face the whole time he was performing. In fact, the whole band did. And yeah, they just, everybody actually, if you sort of look at some of the videos, um, a lot of the performers are just smiling as they're singing and they just look genuinely happy to be there. Diesel was another artist that um, I was able to check out and as usual he put on a blistering performance, really really enjoyed him. just pan it around it's casual it's laid back um, diesel's playing in the background um, or in the crossroads bar now there were times when we weren't able to kind of see the whole set because it may have clashed with other performers but it was fine you know you saw three or four um, songs and sort of moved on to the next performer and I guess that's the way to do it at Blues Fest you don't really sort of have have a chance to always see the whole performance so yeah, Diesel was fantastic. Global greats, would you please welcome George Benson. George Benson, wow. Um, probably the highlight of the whole festival for me. Um, what did I like about him? Everything. His music, his guitar. Craftsmanship, his smile, his um, connection with the audience. He was really good. He had some, you know, boppy songs as well as the slower songs and just really, yeah, top notch. He, um, yeah, just can't explain it. He was fantastic. Loved him. The world may change my whole 
Oh, oh.